Yo guys, before we get into the video today, if you could go and check out my second channel, which is content like this. Three, two, one. Oh my god, it's coming in! It's coming in! Then make sure to go and subscribe to it, leave a like and turn on post notifications. I have tons of new videos coming soon, but apart from that, let's get straight back into the video. Yo guys, what's going on and welcome back to our video today. And as you see my title, this is the best AFK Renown actual farming method on Rainbow Six Siege after Operation Steel Wave. Now, in the last few days or weeks since the actual kind of new Operation Steel Wave come out, there has not been many glitches. That's why I've been lack of glitches videos, but I've been providing other content for you guys just in case you do enjoy it and it does help you out. Also, I won't be uploading every single day from now on because it's been quite nice weather, so I want to take some time to relax. However, I've got some new videos that obviously I have pre-recorded and I will be editing and uploading them, but maybe it might be like an upload one day and then upload not another day. So, yeah, that's just how it's going to go for maybe like a week or so while the weather is nice and then when the weather does change, I'll probably go back to uploading every single day. But apart from that, let's get straight into it. So first of all, what you want to do is go over to your options and you need to make sure on your matchmaking preferences that the only map is on is going to be tower and the only game of preference is going to be protect the hostage. So once you've done that, you literally just apply it and it's all good to go. So here we go guys, I've literally applied everything and now what you want to do, obviously it used to be called hostage but now it's called training grounds. So go over to their kind of like menu bar, then go over to training grounds and make sure when you go into lone wolf that you keep it on normal. Now this is because the terrorists will get to you within 30 seconds, if they do then you won't get any run out at all. However for the first one you're going to have to play it because you need to kind of set up the kind of AFK part and also you don't get run out for the first actual game. So here we are and the best actual place to defend is going to be Restaurant and what you want to do is also pick Doc so you actually last a lot longer. Now if you can obviously pick your character while obviously being AFK then it will help a lot but character doesn't matter as much, just by being Doc you'll get a lot more renown from being him. So here we go guys, I've literally just spawned in, I'm going to stay right how I am for literally about a minute or two. So here we go guys, I've literally got the terrorists come up to me, they're starting to shoot me, I've lasted probably about a minute to 45 seconds, and obviously like I said, for the first actual game, you're going to get no renown, but this is where you need to start off like your AFK part, and this is where you're going to need a clicker. Now guys, on console you can do it by using the rubber band method, where you obviously just put a rubber band over the button which it clicks the both redrive. Or you can do it multiple ways by obviously the app. So if you can go on Xbox and you have a Windows PC, you can set up an auto clicker so it connects to your Xbox and clicks onto your kind of Xbox if you kind of get a I meme. I can't remember what it's called, but it's through the Xbox app and it's so handy. Now for PS4, you do have to download the PS4 Play app and then download an auto clicker, which should be on your mobile phone. I'm not sure if you can get it on PC or not, but the same way again, it applies. You just vote for retry and you're AFK. Now if you can't do any of those methods, then you just have to press A yourself for vote for retry when it's all done. So you can literally just sit here watching a movie or like a TV show, anything like that, and just press A to vote for retry. So here we go guys, literally finished the mission, I got like 356 renown, don't understand why, but it's because I completed the challenges, so we'll just ignore that, but that should never normally happen in the first game, but literally vote for retry again, and that's where you put your auto clicker over the vote for retry, and again, like I said, if you can pick the operators and you're not doing it the standard AFK way by an auto clicker, then pick dock and restaurant every single time, because you're getting yourself a lot more renown, and it takes about a minute per go. Now guys, the hostages are coming once again, I've literally done nothing, they're right to the left of me, and I can literally just let them kill me, and that's what I'm doing there, they're literally just obliterating me. It does take a while, obviously, but if you're watching a movie, anything like that, or you're doing it overnight, then you aren't going to be bothered, because you aren't going to be seeing anything. Also, this does get you between six to 7,000 renown per hour, which, to be fair, in my opinion, is really, really good when you think about it, because if you do it overnight, and you're sleeping for about eight hours, then you're going to be getting yourself about 50,000 renown while in the morning, so... That is really good, and that is probably about 10 alpha packs, so if you are just about the alpha packs or you want to go get some skins, then this is the best way to do it. So there we go, I got about 47 renown from literally doing it a minute. Now, like I said earlier, I had the challenges, so I managed to get myself about 355 renown, and that was from one game, and that took me like a minute. So if you can complete the challenges by picking any of Ubisoft or operators or anything like that, then recommend doing it honestly because all you got to do is just go over to this little button here and all i got to do now is go and play some multiplayer as a uh, spectrum as gogn anything like that and it's sorted but apart from that there you go just simple nice easy i just did a catch up at the start of the video explain what's been going on, on my channel and apart from that if you did enjoy it leave a like subscribe turn post notifications and check out my other channel but apart from that until next time see ya